are you today? I'm doing great. I like the junkets. You do? Yeah. yeah. Fun. I know not a lot of, I mean, compared to red carpets and stuff, it's just so much more yeah. humane. Get to talk. Right. <laughs> <laughs> great. Well, thank you for talking with me today on behalf of all your fan fans on my website, celebs.com. Um, I think I'd like to start out just talking to you about, this is quite the family affair, but you two haven't worked together for a little while now, right? Well, we wrote uh, Grand Canyon together, and that is a, it's about 10 years. Uh, ten years? 20 years. 20, yeah. <laughs> Hello. I was checking. And we've been married three years. No, wait, 40 years. <laughs> <laughs> I was having to double check my math because I had 21 years. So, um, oh, you're absolutely right. So why so long and why this story? Well, we've been working together every day the, during those 21 years, but we've been working on a life. Uh, we, you know, we have two sons and we have a grandson, and um, we, you know, it's an everyday collaboration. It just happens not to have been about movies uh, every time. Mm -hmm. I went off and I did a bunch of other movies during that time. Yeah. And um, This was just the right thing for us to do together, and um, it was uh, inspired by something that really happened to us, and... Uh, we just had a feeling that we could do this t well together. Now, I can imagine you have a lot of things that happen in your family. Why this moment? Why this story? What's, what's at the heart of this? Now, we had rescued this dog from a shelter in Los Angeles. He was already seven years old. He was a little beat up. He had had a rough background. We didn't even know all the details of it, but you could tell that he had, it had been a little rough. We took him into our house, and we tried to make it good for him. Mm -hmm. And we used to take him to Colorado where we'd go hiking in the mountains. And we went there and we left him with a friend uh, while we went to a wedding and he got lost. A mountain biker came down while they were on the trail. He ran away and we thought he'd just come back. We rushed back to Colorado to try to find him. Mm -hmm. But he didn't show up and after about 10 days we were very discouraged. And then this friend of ours in LA who knew about him heard about it and she said, He's all right. You've just got to keep looking for him. And that was, a, it was an, an interesting experience. And after three weeks, we did get him back. Mm -hmm. And as Meg told that story to people, they said, you know, you ought to write this down. Oh, so there is a Carmen, someone who was spiritually tapping into the animals. Oh, interesting. Yes, so that wasn't really just was someone like all that. made up. And how close is the dynamic between the Mary yearly married couple how how close is that to your relationship because there's a lot of bickering that goes it's on. not really our relationship uh, -huh. uh you know i think certainly there are elements in it um in any marriage uh that's been going on for 40 years people will recognize certain dynamics uh between a couple um and i'm sure there are times we've taken each other for granted and ignored each other uh but it really is not um what our relationship has been. We've seen a lot of relationships where those things can happen. We have experienced them a little bit. Um, actually, the, the loss of the dog and the search for the dog was just a vehicle, really, to look at a lot of different kinds of things. You know, their daughter gets married at the beginning of the movie, and mm -hmm. then there's this young relationship between the doctor and the Carmen. Mm -hmm. And then there's this midlife relationship where this just starting between Diane Wiest and Richard Jenkins. Mm -hmm. And we were just as interested in that as anything mm -hmm. else. Yeah, what, When you find someone who doesn't seem right for you, other people on the outside say, why are they together? Mm -hmm. But the, none of that matters. Only thing that matters is between the two people themselves and what, what works between them. And was Kevin Klein was the role always his? Because you've worked together, what, six times now? We've worked together six times. So was it always his job? <laughs> we really didn't have anybody in mind when we were writing it. And then the second we finished it, all these names jumped into our head. Mm -hmm. And we got them all. They all said yes. We were astounded. I like how you're surprised. <laughs> <laughs> Who has ever said no to you? <laughs> oh, there have been times. <laughs> Thank but you not so this much. Time. Thank you. <laughs>